Hey everyone, I'm here with the Rough Riders head coach, Chris uh, Megaludis. Coach, you guys got the job done when the pressure was on in the playoff race. Yeah, no, we, uh, we needed this win. Um, all these games matter. Uh, every, every game is important now. So we're heading towards the end of the season and you know we knew that it's always going to be tough, but we're happy with the win. Now we just got to keep going. You guys created so many chances tonight. You created so many chances on Wednesday. It took a while for the first one to go in. Did it start to feel like deja vu? Do you feel like the way you guys were playing, eventually something was going to come? Yeah, you know, we, we feel as though when you're creating those chances, that's, that's you know, a good, uh, a good feeling. We want to continue now just obviously understanding that when you don't put away those chances, you got to come back and just have that short-term memory and get after the next one. Um, but we know the quality that these players have, and... Uh, eventually, you know, we knew that the goals would come and they will come. They'll continue to come. So we have faith in all the players, uh, in all different types of roles. So we know that we're capable of doing it. And uh, it wasn't an issue for us. It took a little bit longer than we hoped, but uh, we, we were able to score three today and hopefully continue scoring more goals going forward. Do you think uh, once McLean's goal in, Justin's that first one, which is a brilliant lob, do you think it just took some of the weight off the shoulders because this, the second half was two really well worked goals as well? Yeah, I think scoring a goal late in any type of, uh, in, a, in you know, in the first half, any late goal always contributes to a momentum that, that gives us, uh, you know, the tempo, what we want moving uh, in that direction. So the second half, we came out with that feeling of, all right, we want nothing up. We want to go for more. We want to keep, uh, keep the press high, continue to force players to, to adapt and get forward and, and shoot more. So once we did that, I think the second, third goals were, were, um, were going to eventually come, and they did. I wanted to ask you about Kieran Chandler, because he turned 19 a month ago, created the, the second and third goal. He's been a, a store in your team. How far do you think he can go? I mean, Kieran, uh, he's been a, not, I, w I don't want to say a surprise. We knew exactly what he was capable of doing when we recruited him, but um, he's been fantastic for us. You know, a lot of players have been, all, all of these players have been fantastic. He's been a bright spot um, in multiple roles as well. So we have him pushed up the field a little bit more and we see that he's able to, uh, to do things. You know, he's able to create goals, get, get down the line, get crosses in, take players on. So good to see a player like that with that level of confidence. And, um, you know, he's doing really well, doing really well. I'm not sure if you saw the, the other scores tonight, but Motown drew Manhattan. Probably the ideal result for you guys. You've gone three points clear at the top again. Three away games to finish it out. Staten Island Monarchs, which you know is going to be a test, then Westchester, and then Manhattan Soccer Club. And it, it, on paper, they're all tough, but it's, it's a sort of, it's a difficult, it's the difficulty ramp goes up every time. What do you think is going to be the key for you guys to see out these final few weeks and get to the playoffs? I think just the new unity that the team has, uh, the understanding that it's a game by game process. Um, Right now, the only thing we're looking forward to is uh, recovering from today, getting into practice, uh, and and focusing for the game in on uh, on Wednesday versus Staten Island. So, I think it's a game by game thing. To look that far ahead, it's um, I think just puts more anxiety into the into the players. But we're we're in a happy we're in a we're in a good spot right now. We just want to keep moving, and um, you know do it little by little. Coach, congratulations on the victory tonight. Thank you. And uh, we'll see you uh, at Staten Island on Wednesday. Yeah, thank you guys. All right.